Hey everyone, my name is Benj Heish. I'm a wedding and elopement photographer based in the Pacific Northwest. And about a month ago, I did a rare travel engagement session. I usually don't travel for engagement photos at all. Um, but since this year has been just so crazy and so many of my um, normal travel things have canceled and my clients who are getting married out in Montana next year as well wanted me to go out, I figured let's take a trip. Let's go see a national park that I haven't seen since I was a kid and um, go check that out. So I flew in and only had a couple days, which included the sunrise shoot the next morning, um, but spent a lot of time and pretty much all of my free time on that trip, um, just exploring the park and checking all that stuff out. Um, I tried to keep my kit really small because I was going to be there for such a short period of time. So I only brought all of my digital gear, which are those digital Leicas back there, uh, as well as my Leica M6, and then my Fujifilm Class W, both of which, and all of which actually, I've done videos on on my YouTube channel before. So if you wanna go check those out, you can. And as the whole reason I was actually there was for this engagement session, I did the same thing um, where I recorded that shoot um, on the top of my camera with an iPhone, it goes in depth a lot into uh, how I pose people and how I do kind of composition. And you can kind of see a lot of the behind the scenes from that shoot as well. I will be posting that on my Patreon feed this month. And if you're interested, uh, it'll be really interesting. I find it actually more interesting than this video too, um, because you get to see a little behind the scenes and interactions and stuff like that from that shoot as well. So let me know if you guys like this format. Uh, I find these really interesting. So um, if you do, let me know in the comments below and let's get into it. So I'm out here, Glacier National Park, have my like an M6 with an iPhone mount because I don't have a GoPro. So we're going to be doing a little behind the scenes, take you with me. Um, it's not the best, but it'll do for now. I also brought the Fujifilm Class W. Um, so pairing the 28 on the Fujifilm with the 50 on the Leica and should be a good combo. Come down from the stars. Show your human scars Tell me what it's like to believe Through my Christ haunted thoughts That the losses you bought Are the nights that you peopled with your dreams Well, I've got no answers For heartbreaks or cancers But a savior who suffers them with me Singing goodbye, Olympus, the heart of my maker is spread out on the road, the rocks and the weeds. Come down from your mountain, your high rise apartment. Tell me of the God you know who bleeds. And I failed to feel her heaviness with peace Well, I've got no answers for her needs or cancers But a savior who suffers them with me Singing goodbye, Olympus, the heart of my maker Spread out on the road, the rocks and the weeds Crop I know I'll never leave to read And sell my body to my maker And my heart unto my savior And spread me on the road, the rocks and the weeds Spread me on the road Feel it now every 
said hits me hard and it cuts me deep I'm a thousand miles from happiness Thousand miles from you It's a far reach from you to me I feel the time and the space between I'm not around, but I'm not gone I miss the bed you're sleeping on I'm a thousand miles from coziness Thousand miles from you looking for Just trying to get this road to line up there So thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help push the channel forward. Uh, a couple things that are sort of of note, you're gonna see in that video, there were a few frames um, that had some weird kind of streaking in them. I was told by the lab that that was actually a defect on the negative itself, because I'm assuming I'm gonna get some comments about that. Uh, I have a film fridge, and the mistake that I had made was I took a bunch of film out to get ready to prep for this uh, engagement session and this whole trip. And I didn't let it acclimate before just like taking it straight out of the fridge uh, in an 80 degree office or whatever and just shoving it straight in my camera. So uh, word of advice for those who shoot film and may refrigerate their film or might have a really well air conditioned house and they live in some like Florida. Um, you might want to just, you know, try to get your film to acclimate so you don't get that streaking on there. And then again, if you're interested in seeing the behind the scenes of the engagement session that I did, all that kind of stuff is up on Patreon, uh, as well as tons of other videos that I talk about editing and gear and how I do things. Um, a lot of the kind of inner workings about scouting locations and um, composition and editing. And so if you're interested, that's on there as well. So thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.